Sometimes learning a magic trick from written instructions is really difficult. Let me show you what I mean. For this trick, all you need is a two euro coin, an old English penny, and a Chinese coin. Now the instructions say, if you take out the old English penny and the two euro, like this, um, you place them in your right hand, leaving the other two coins in your left hand. You now this is why I get confused, because it could be the Chinese coin in your right hand and the other two coins in your left hand. I always get confused with this sort of stuff. Um, the other thing uh, you could do when you read the instructions is take the old English penny and pop that in your pocket. Or is it the Chinese coin you put in your pocket? I really get confused with this, this sort of effect. In fact, it might be the two euro. Maybe you put the two euro away, or maybe you don't put it away. It's really, really strange when you're reading these sort of instructions. Um, even if we were to take, let's say, the Chinese coin, put that in my pocket, is it a Chinese coin? Or do you leave the Chinese coin in your hand and put the other two coins in your pocket? Learning effects from written instructions is very confusing, as I said. Um, maybe you take the Old English penny and you take the two euro, take both of those, put those, no, that you leave those in your hand, I'm sure you do, it's the Chinese coin you put in your pocket. I'm really confused, but that's the two euro, that's the Old English penny, that's the Chinese coin, everything can be examined, and that is my version of the Oriental ship.